In Ginny Gordon in the Lending Library, by Julie Campbell, the narrative intertwines adventure with a charming depiction of community life, reflecting the values and social dynamics of its time. The story centers around Ginny Gordon, a spirited young girl who stumbles upon a new challenge in her small town when a mysterious figure begins to disrupt the local lending library. The plot kicks off with Ginny discovering that the town's cherished library, a hub of knowledge and community gatherings, has been experiencing peculiar disturbances. Books are going missing, and the once organized shelves are found in disarray. This predicament sets the stage for Ginny's investigative journey, showcasing her inquisitiveness and determination. Ginny's character is portrayed as perceptive and brave, qualities that endear her to readers. Her enthusiasm for solving the mystery drives the narrative, and her interactions with other characters highlight her resourcefulness. As she delves deeper into the mystery, Ginny encounters various townsfolk, each contributing to the unfolding drama. These interactions are significant as they reveal the library's central role in the community and the diverse personalities that animate the town. The author uses the lending library as a symbol of communal bonds and shared cultural values. The disruption caused by the missing books and disorganized shelves represents a threat to the town's social fabric. Ginny's quest to restore order reflects a broader theme of preserving communal harmony and upholding the values of trust and cooperation. Through Ginny's eyes, readers witness the importance of maintaining such communal spaces as they foster connections and contribute to the town's sense of identity. The narrative structure is engaging, with Ginny's investigation unfolding through a series of clues and encounters. This episodic approach keeps the reader intrigued, with each chapter revealing new aspects of the mystery. Ginny's methodical approach to solving the problem interviewing suspects, examining evidence, and piecing together information, mirrors classic detective work, yet it remains accessible and relatable for young readers. Julie Campbell's writing is marked by its clarity and warmth. The descriptions of the library and the town evoke a sense of nostalgia and familiarity, drawing readers into a world where community and tradition are cherished. The language is straightforward, making the story easy to follow, while the dialogue captures the personalities of the characters effectively. The narrative balance between suspense and everyday life ensures that the story remains engaging without overwhelming younger readers. The resolution of the mystery is satisfying, with Ginny uncovering the identity of the culprit and restoring the library to its former state. The resolution is not only about finding the person responsible but also about reaffirming the values that the library symbolizes. Through Ginny's success, the story emphasizes the importance of perseverance, integrity, and the collective effort of a community working together. In addition to its mystery elements, the book also explores themes of friendship and personal growth. Ginny's interactions with her friends and family reveal her supportive nature and the strong relationships that underpin her character. These relationships provide a backdrop to her investigation highlighting how personal connections can influence and support one's endeavors. Overall, Ginny Gordon in the Lending Library offers a heartwarming and engaging story that combines the excitement of a mystery with a celebration of community and shared values. Julie Campbell crafts a narrative that is both entertaining and meaningful, providing readers with a glimpse into a world where curiosity, courage, and cooperation triumph. Through Ginny's adventure, the book underscores the significance of communal spaces and the role they play in fostering a sense of belonging and collective responsibility.